Hi, my name is Becky Dennis, board president of Encephalitis 411, a certified nonprofit that aims to improve the lives of those impacted by encephalitis. Most people have never heard of encephalitis. It's swelling of the brain and can be caused by numerous things from viral agents that mosquitoes and ticks carry or viruses like COVID or herpes to autoimmune causes where our own body attacks the brain. The problem, there are so few resources available to help families or doctors for that matter. There are so many unknowns and with the exception of one cause, there are zero cures. Families are left to navigate on their own, often taking advice from other survivors. They need organizations like ours for reliable, fact-based information, especially given the lifelong aftermath of this awful brain injury that leaves most families financially ruined. Encephalitis 411 provides 100% free resources to families and clinicians. These range from a hotline where we offer one-on-one -on -one help for patients or caregivers in crisis, to hosting online or in-person meetings, supporting research and clinical trials, presenting to healthcare educational institutions, prepping individuals before doctor appointments, and conducting complex case reviews via our medical faculty. So why am I telling you this? Because we launched a virtual walk that will run through July 28th. This is partially to honor those who lost their battle, such as 12-year-old Nicole Seeler, and for those who are fighting the daily battle. With a modest registration fee of $40, you can help us continue to provide free support to accommodate our mission. We encourage you to challenge five of your friends, families, or colleagues to join you in the Take a Hike Encephalitis Walk this year. Together, we can help raise awareness, provide more research, and advocate for those lost in our medical system. As many of you know, I was personally impacted by this illness 13 plus years ago. What you don't see is the invisible outcomes, such as insomnia, erratic blood pressure, migraines, dizziness, blurred visions, and so many other symptoms that survivors put up with on a daily basis. So please take that 40 bucks you're gonna throw at fast food, a happy hour or an impulse buy and consider joining our battle against encephalitis instead. Thanks in advance for your support.